Hey everyone, my name is Chris. Welcome back to another Dead Space 2 Hardcore Mode Let's Play. Alright, just um, showing you once again that it is Hardcore Mode. And I have one save remaining as you can see. Hopefully I'll get to that without dying after we start all these recordings from here. Uh, we'll see. Alright, let me take a quick look at what I got. I forgot what I had since I last played. I, I did play just yesterday, so I shouldn't be too rusty. Alright, no pulse. Oh, I got a bunch of pulse rifle rounds, a bunch of river blades. This is the important part of this fight, the stasis. Do I got stasis? I do. And, um, yeah, I should be good to go. This is not really a particularly hard fight. Matter of fact, I don't plan on killing anything. But, um, we'll see how it goes. Ellie, there's a giant tentacle blocking the transport door. It's wrapped around a big tank. A big tank? Nitrogen trichloride. Those explode if they overheat. Yeah, yeah. This fight is actually pretty easy to manage without killing a damn thing. And I'll that attempt, works. I'll attempt to show you how to do that. Hopefully I won't screw it up. And do yourself a favor, if you're here, um, this fight will not start until you, not just, not just take a, one of these canisters out of the wall, this fight will not start at all until you fire one of those canisters at the, at the tank and damage it. So grab these things on the side. Pull one of these out, drop it on the floor in front of you. Grab the sucker and let's do it. And look who we have here. Take one of these off real quick. All right. Now what you're gonna do with this is leave this cocksucker stasis. Just kind of let him do his thing while he's stasis. Keep throwing shit at these. And he's about to get grabbed. Oh, yep, yeah, he's gonna hit me. He's gonna try. Need some more stasis. Whoa, what the hell was that? What the hell am I? You guys see this? I have no way to get up there now. What the hell? Oh, boy. Reset. Weird. Please. I want to keep this in just so you guys can see this. Just so you guys can see the weirdness that was me getting screwed over like that. I think I'll keep this part of the recording in. Why not? If this kills me. Hopefully there is a time limit. Yeah, I know I need to go up there, but it knocked me off. Glitch knocked me off. I can't even kill myself with grenades. Weird. Yeah, I want to leave that in just so you guys can see that. That was the weirdest, weirdest death I've ever, or a weirdest little, excuse me, adjust my mic. The weirdest little glitch I've ever experienced in this game. I will attempt to slow down a bit, I guess. What the fuck was that, man? Talk about getting screwed over, right? Alright. I want to keep that in just because it was interesting. Nitrogen trichloride. Those explode if they overheat. Perfect. Alright, but I think you get the gist, the general idea of this uh, quote unquote fight. Because really, all you're doing is mangling him and then making a break for it while he can do absolutely nothing to you, provided you keep, keep him nice and stasis. Alright. 
really hesitant to just like go so cavalier this time just because I don't want I don't want glitches to happen. Alright, fuck it, let's go. Oh, let's dismember you in midair. Of course I don't think this fight will go as well. Stasis on this dude either. Or wasting these stasis packs. There we go. Alright. As an example of how to properly do it when the game doesn't fuck with you. Weird. But it only lost about a minute of recording on that anyway. So, I figure I'll show you a glitch in the game that I found. First time I've seen that. She's like, what do you want me to do? Looks like you were screwed there. In another situation, I might admire your persistence, Mr. Clark. I love his stern look, he's like, Bastard, why won't you die? Alright. At this point, it's all just dead weight. What does he mean by that? Isaac, what did he mean? What did he mean when he said dead weight? <laughs> he's using the solar beam. We gotta stop the transport now. Awesome. That's awesome. And we're going to the Ishimura. He's cut the station in half. There's no track to get across all I actually do like the Ishimura. The that part is what fun to me. Just do it, Ellie. Hurry. The Ishimura. If the gravity tethers are still functional, I can... You can snag off second, drag it back? Isaac, this is ridiculous. <laughs> if I can line the tracks up just for a few He's seconds, like, no you shit. should be able to get the transport across. Stay ready. And take care of Strauss. Isaac, no. This is a really bad idea. I'll stick around. Full of bad ideas. <laughs> you gotta love Isaac. Alright. The Shimura, remember at first it was pretty it's pretty damn scary place. But not so much anymore. I'm gonna rip it rip everything apart in this bitch. And the good thing about it is there's not very many threats until you encounter the brutes about probably a third of the way through the first section. And then um they try to spring a trap on you. But <laughs> with proper knowledge of the game beforehand, we will escape that trap. Yeah, I love this game. I can't get enough of this game at all. It's in the same vein of Resident Evil 4 and 5 and stuff like that. But actually, I think Dead Space is much scarier. And more interesting at times, too. The weapons. atmosphere in this place is awesome. Chapter 10. Don't fuck this up, Chris. <laughs> Anywhere before chapter I think 13 or 14 where right before the eye poke machine. That's where I save it. A lot of room for error here. Or, I mean, not a lot of room. A lot of potential for error and not very much room. What do we have here? I don't think I've ever noticed that. The wall locker right there. I know there's a canister to the right that I can pick up. Just get this stuff out of the way. Alright, let's go grab that. And there's a power node in this direction, along with, I think, a health pack and a, text, a couple text logs. Something over here to scare you. Not to mention that crazy ex girlfriend of mine is going to start talking to us pretty soon.
I miss the days when she actually only talked to us when there was dementia. Now it seems like every two seconds she's speaking to you. Alright. Damn it. That's what I thought. Gotta go to engineering. The gravity centrifuge is under repair. I'm gonna have to go down to engineering. This should be interesting. Is it safe? I don't know how it could be. I'll let you know. Alright, let's go do our thing. Unlike Isaac, I am absolutely not at the risk for bodily harm. So it doesn't matter to me. I just have the inconvenience of re-recording everything <laughs> from my last save. Sorry about how short the last video was, but as you can as you can understand, I needed a break from the game after recording everything from the very beginning of the game straight until my second save. And I don't want to like start a fre uh, segment with the save, um, like kind of like with the save halfway, because potential for death and then I had to re-record a section that you would have to watch again so it's just not good all right let's upgrade some stuff I think we have five nodes now so let's see what we can get rig we'll throw one in that direction throw one in this direction can I get any damage anytime soon I don't know how viable alt fire is, so I'm just gonna go for this direction. I like this. And I'll keep a node around. Pretty sure I remember some node locked doors in this place. I could think of two that I definitely remember. So we didn't do a whole lot of increase in our stuff, but we we're covering the nodes in between. I'm just gonna blitz to this place as fast as possible while not dying. Other items are here. I think there's another item in here. Nope, that's what I get to thinking. Oh, over here. Wall locker. Yeah, more blades. Two river blades equals like potential for four or five enemy deaths, depending on who they are. Ah, yes. You don't scare me. Grab a text log for no reason. More pulse rifle rounds. It's good stuff. about to encounter our first enemies in this place. So let's switch to the Ripper, because it is a brute. Brutes are some tough customers. How, many, how much stasis do I have? Oh, I got a ton. All right, I'm gonna utilize those extra packs if I have to. So what I do here, because there's two brutes in this room, and so I destroy the first one as fast as I can. That's usually not a problem, as you'll see very shortly unless he kills me which you then you won't see it because I'll record it yeah, bitch not get back up he gave me a stasis pack where's my money god damn it money man all right so in this brute I activate him then I turn around and run far away you'll be able to see him activate in the distance just grabbing this extra ammo Come on, motherfucker. There he is. Whoa! Run away, run away. He's actually quite a distance away from you. So 
so. Just gonna unload a little bit of ammo into him. From this far away. Soften him up. Alright, bitch. Let's go. Winning! <laughs> And the ambush, which would have caught you right in the middle. Isaac, Isaac, they're into the ship. Nope. Yeah, I know. I'll call you back. Come on, bitch. Why are you so docile now? Yeah. Reload while I can. I think some elite slashers are coming. I think that's elite slasher. Easy, easy. Gotta be an elite slasher coming. Thought I saw an elite slasher. Weird. Oh! What's up, motherfucker? That shit. Eat it. Yeah. Is there something I couldn't pick up? I think I hear they wanted the fatties. Have a seat, bitch. Wow. Ah, damn it. Kill. Holy shit. How many of them were there? Not my best kill of those guys, but little demons don't hardly do anything. I should have used this stasis pod. I usually do. It's a little oversight on my part, but stasis regenerates itself anyway. And there's a stasis replenishment right over here. Try to scare me with fallen objects. Not be deterred. All right, let's open the shit. No shit. Well, I'm on my way to the centrifuge. Just be careful. I'll call you when it's online. There's a couple rooms in the medical wing that really worry me as far as my ability to not die. Aside from that, the Ishimura isn't so bad. Like, the brutes are actually pretty damn easy to deal with. Right. So, here's our main, I guess, the main hub area you would call it. Closest thing to a main hub this place has. Alright. Let's check what we got. I just got a diamond. I think it was a diamond conductor from that brute. Wow. I got a lot of health. I'll sell some of those too. I don't, I don't need them all. Sell that diamond semiconductor. Sell the extra stasis pack. Because like I said. My previous videos, I roll with two in the two in the bank and one in the inventory. Stack up three, that is. Got a lot of ammo. We could buy some more nodes. Buy four more nodes. God, I'm rolling in money this playthrough. Hope I don't screw that up. Uh, actually, hold on a second. We grab one of those health packs from my safe and use it real quick just to top myself off. I should be good. Good to go, man. Text log, audio log that I'm not going to listen to. Oh, 
Oh wait, there's one off. There's another sticky area. The leaving the decom decontamination area, which kind of sucks, but you guys will see that. Nah, in the next probably 20 minutes or so. Come on. Yeah, here's entering the decontamination. Leaving section. This is what, what blows. The, it's easy items. But you'll see what I mean. Oh, and there's another bench up here, too. Awesome. So it's a good thing I bought those power nodes. Good timing. I forgot about this bench. Alright, well, I'll upgrade these, and then I will call it for this episode. But <laughs> I'm doing a full playthrough anyway. So it's not like I'm going to be stopping. Alright, get the duration. So this thing is almost full. I do like the alternate fire, so we'll, we'll get to those. But I want to power other things up first. Get some more capacity. Wait. Get one more closer to the health. One more on the duration of this. Stasis is a beast. Oh, I missed this duration. Why did I ignore that? I I'll get that next time. That was foolish of me. This whole time I ignored that duration. Ah well. Many oversights. But I'll get it. And so far so good anyway. I'm sure people will let me know. Alright, how big is this clip now? 125, that's awesome. Get it some more power and man, watch out, this gun is kinda beast. Never realized how good it was. All right, we'll get out of this decontamination room, and then I'll grab the ball locker items and cut it off for next time. This room just like screams setup, though. Like you're you're thinking you're screwed on the way through, but then again, as soon as you come back on the way back, you're like, yeah, something's going down. River blades, more river blades. Awesome. All right, thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next episode.